So yeah, I know the baseball season started a little over a week ago, now closer to two weeks ago, but I thought I would still turn this into some kind of vlog and put it out there for you guys because I had a lot of fun at opening day and I thought I would share it with you guys. So by the time I got to the drop, they were just finishing up BP. So I decided if I want any chance at getting any kind of autograph, I needed to go over to the line right away. So that's exactly what I did. I went over there right away as soon as I entered the stadium. I sat in line and this is what happened. After a few minutes of waiting in line, Brett Phillips came out and he was the only player that came out and he was signing autographs for all the fans. I mean, this is what I love about Brett Phillips. He makes time before games and sometimes even after games to go up to fans, hug them, take pictures and sign autographs. That is exactly what makes baseball fun and why I love him so much. So not gonna lie, the closer I got to Brett Phillips in line, the more nervous I got because I'm like, what am I gonna say? How am I gonna react? And this is what I did. After he signed my autograph, I ended up posing for a thumbnail. I mean, I could've done anything other than that, but hey, great thumbnail, I guess. Thanks, Brett Phillips. Like, seriously, I really appreciate him taking the time to not only sign my ball, but hey, pose for a picture for my thumbnail. Really cool guy. So after I got the autograph by Brett Phillips, I actually went over back to my seats and I actually met one of you guys. Big shout out to you. I'm not going to say your name because I don't know if you want it out there, but hey, you know who you are. Thank you so much for saying hello. Well, before we continue with this vlog, I just want to let you guys know if you use code Harrison Sawyer, you will get $20 off your first purchase on SeatGeek. Yes, so go over to SeatGeek right now if you plan on going to any sporting event, concert, or anything like that. Again, use code Harrison Sawyer. You will get $20 off. And trust me, you'll save a lot on just fees in general. So definitely use that code. Thank you guys so much. And something rare that I got to witness was unrevealing one of the brand new banners for the Rays. 2021 American League champs. This is something not every single team gets to review on opening day. So it's something very special. And I'm so happy that I was there to see them take this off the banner and show it. 2021 AL East champs. Definitely something to be proud of for the Rays. There's just something about the national anthem at not only open day, but baseball games in general. It's just something that I absolutely love. Going back to high school baseball games, standing there on the field, listening to the national anthem, and now at the TROP, every game that I not only work at, but also go to, I just absolutely love it. But anyways, of course, after the natural anthem, that was when the season was pretty much about to begin. And it was just so awesome to be back at the TROP, watch everyone warm up, and just get the season started. And something you don't see very often, the first pitch of the season was a hit by pitch. Change starting things off by throwing some heat right into the shoulder of Baltimore's leadoff hitter. Oh, what? 
Alright guys, so I didn't really add any commentary over any of these clips and that's because it was a packed house. It was loud, the music, the crowd, everything, but it was such a fun time. Shout out to Brett Phillips for signing a autograph, taking a selfie with me, and a little short video clip. So awesome. One of my favorite players on the Rays. I mean, he's just so hyped and awesome. Here is a ball that he signed. Very, very awesome. I actually just bought a case to put it in. And also the case is 12 and one. So I'll be able to put a lot more signed balls in it as well throughout the season. I did catch a ball during the game. It was a toss up from Manuel Margot. That was really awesome. I caught it in between innings. And yeah, that was awesome and I gave it away. So really awesome. So far this season, I've caught three balls. My record is one in one season. So having three in within two games, well, basically one, it's pretty awesome. But anyway, guys, enough rambling. I hope you guys enjoyed what I did record. I don't know how long this is or how it will turn out, but hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Drop a comment down below on what your predictions are for the AL East and the Rays. And maybe I'll catch you guys at a Rays game in the future. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you later. <laughs>